Hi, welcome to Sariba Online Multilist Database Service. In this video, we will see how to manage the listing page. You can find on your video screen, this is the dashboard. If you click on the listing menu, you will go to the Manage Listings page automatically. There are two options, Manage Listings and Add Listing. Once you click on the listing, you will come to Manage Listings page. On this Manage Listing page, the database, the Sariba ML system allows you uh, multiple features for managing your properties. These are basically all your real estate's properties listed. In the tabular format, you will find first the image, MLS number, block number, parcel number, property name, property information, original price and current price, status, broker status, Sariba status, days on market and quick action with various icons inside them. So here you can see on the first section you will see a button add new if you click on this this will take you to add listing page where you can add new properties to the list this is the main listing for all the properties made on this system for you these are show and hide buttons if you just click on this and uncheck this checkbox you will find that days on market column will disappear you can see that the column disappeared if you check it again this will reappear will see with original price disappearing the same way if you want a way previous market to appear you got to check on them if you check on it previous market appears you can search properties by filters for example all the properties that are residential will appear if you click here and select the residential type all the properties in list that are residential will appear you can make multiple selection and select according to the need of yours if you select residential and you want a residential property that is new just click on residential and click residential property new all the new properties that are residential will appear if you want residential property that is new along with Sariba status pending you just click pending you will find you will find this property only three properties with this filters having this filters with this Sariba status with this property type and this status so now this is how you use the filters for the time being we will remove the filters and you can see the total number of properties being displayed here on this on this column and by this drop down you can select the number of properties you want to display on this table for example you just want 10 properties out of 33 only 10 properties will display you can see the change let us see 25 property the number of properties will increase on a single page view and with this call with this space you can search for the properties this is a f search feature just by typing down the MLS number for the property you can search for the property let's see or you can type the area or property name the property with this MLS number appears on the screen just remove the MLS number and just type the property name and you will find properties with this name appears on the dashboard and you can rearrange the properties on the list with this gray arrows you can rearrange according to the alphabetical order for narrowing your search saving your time you can see that the A to Z order is arranged
now you cannot you can see the broker and sariba status colors being changing if they are pending it's yellow if there is if that is declined the property is declined it is red and if the property is approved it is green and with this you can view the history for the property any modifications that has been made to the property with this you can see the documents attached to the property you have already seen this in the past video in how to manage dashboard and you can also find in details how to manage documents you can click on the edit property to edit any detail on the property and to the listing if you want to add photograph to the property the image here you can click on photo to add videos you can click here to add videos you can add also virtual tour videos any link here so this is how you manage the listing page and in the next videos you will find how to add new properties let us see by clicking on this button you can go to the add new properties and add new listings here on the manage listings page